Hey guys, Silent Seal here. Welcome to the month of March's unboxing video. And this time round, we've got, well, lesser stuff to open, which is a good thing because lesser money is being spent. It's always a good thing to spend less money. But at the same time, oh, is there a lot of stuff still coming out that I probably want to grab my hands on. But, you know, finances are a bit harsh during this time of trouble. Uh, you know, with this pandemic that's going around the whole world. Everyone, please, please practice good hygiene. Wash your hands. You know, put on a face mask if required when you need to go out of the house to do your daily necessities like grocery shopping and that kind of stuff. Please be safe in your own country wherever you are and let's get down to unboxing what i have for the month of march so in the month of march i do have a parcel that i'm really really looking forward to opening because it has some content that is um, pretty exciting for myself and any macross fan or any anime fan out there because it's got to do with voice acting um artists you know and singers whatever that kind of sort of stuff so anyways my first tiny package is from army army yes you can tell it's pretty tiny <laughs> which is a good thing so let's open this up and see what i got because i literally cannot remember for the good of my own mind um yeah i'm getting old <laughs> memory is fading so okay i probably should have opened it from the bottom because hmm I don't know. All right, so let's slice this from the bottom. All right, I almost got it open. And there we go. Yeah, opening from the bottom. Okay, oh, things are falling out. Let's pull out all the tiny stuff. And wow, that's it. Okay, so not much as you can tell and right so i'm tossing the box aside and let's get down to seeing what we have in this box so here it is the final volume of dr stone to complete my collection of blu-ray for the series season one at least well they did announce season two for dr stone so i'm really really looking forward to it uh let me know in the comments down below if you guys are looking forward to season two of dr stone i definitely need my fix of nerdy science and uh you know of i don't know earth science and all the kind of stuff oh 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 so volume six actually comes with an acrylic stand ha huh. Oh, that's, that's pretty interesting. Um, I wasn't expecting it because, um, you know, I, I did get like, I think I did get the regular edition of the Blu-ray. So I didn't expect Army Army to have any special bonuses attached to it. So let's open this up to take a look at what is included. So here we go. So I guess, I guess she's definitely the most um, iconic female character in Dr. Stone at this point of time because well, she has been with Senku throughout most of the journey except for you know like um, well there is another female character but you know Senku doesn't have any interest in her I suppose <laughs> if you want to put it that way all right so moving along outside of Dr. Stone I have a tiny well-made costume this one is from the official nandroid doll series so yeah so aside from those that i got um that are not actually official from good smile so this one is definitely official so looking forward to see ranka wearing this in the future uh and of course i have another this i think this is blu-ray or dvd i'm not too sure the case looks like it's a dvd case and that would be kind of sad if it is a dvd oh it is a blu-ray it says here blu-ray but the box quality is that of a dvd so yes it is the yugioh anniversary um uh, animation chronicle it has all the openings and ending songs of all the six series um not including the latest one that's going to be shown i'm not too sure what the title of the latest one is that one is based off like the mobile game for Yu-Gi-Oh, um where the card gaming is no longer the five 
um, slot fields for magic and monsters um, it's now the mobile game version where it's only just three slots and three slots so I do not know the title of that series that Yu-Gi-Oh is going into I have not caught up with Yu-Gi-Oh ever since um, I don't know I, I can't remember the title of this one either <laughs> because I only watched like the first 10 episodes and um, I kind of lost touch with it so I think it's time to re-catch on my Yu-Gi-Oh um, knowledge <laughs> so but either way um, the rest of them definitely most people are very um, have very iconic feels or nostalgic feels for them especially if you're a first gen Yu-Gi-Oh um, fan and player like me i i've played Yu-Gi-Oh since the dual monsters era or even before that i have touched the bandai versions of the cards which were you know sold in the gachapon machines back then um yeah so yes i'm i'm super old school Yu-Gi-Oh. so anyway guys let's move on to the next box um we have i think this is the one that i'm really anticipating so this one this one i can't remember which company this is from oh it's cd japan okay so yes it's from cd japan and it's the one that i think i'm most looking forward to so yes guys let's open this up i'm gonna rip it off uh, and do this hopefully as quickly as i can because i cannot wait i need to see the contents of this box and i need to see the contents of the item as well um eventually <laughs> all right so let's do this it's kind of a squarish box um oh 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 it's not what i expected in fact it is something else that i ordered uh, that i almost forgot i did okay so let me take out all the goodies first and here we go lots of stuffing around the floor right now okay and of course my squeaky chair so um alongside with yes more yuru camp madness um i have been going through yuru camp craze for the past two months now i think um yeah catching up with um you know uh, an anime that has been shown since 2018 i think Yuru Cam was at 2018 so yeah all right so i got some of the stuff out so okay um Yuru Cam related stuff first so it's the soundtrack the original soundtrack for heya camp yeah so you can see nadeshiko and gang all right so definitely you will probably hear some soundtracks from this cd in this video somewhere <laughs> or in fact now um yeah so looking forward to using more of the soundtracks with my videos of course softly because copyright issues then of course the latest volume of um karakai jozu um takagi san yeah this is the normal regular series not the moto series where they are actually grown up so it's, this is actually the special edition that comes with the the calendar you know that's pretty nice and i think there's stickers at the bottom as well so stickers so yeah so i'm looking forward to the moto series to reach volume 13 as well i'd like to see how they will, the artists would draw um takagi san and maybe chi um you know because she's part of the family now so <laughs> looking forward to volume 13 of the moto series and see how the illustrations will match up together um you know with this one so yes and then there's another series of manga that i'm following um that is also from the same manga car of takagi san which is this one so as you can tell i'm trying to catch up with all all of it right now so these are the current three volumes that are available for this series um so i think it's what is it called um sore demo uh ayumu wa yosete kuru so yeah it's a pretty it's a pretty cheesy love story if you like takagi san if you like takagi san's teasing this 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 is actually way better this series is actually way better than takagi san in terms of um being teased and um you know um 
I would say showing affection to the other partner secretly. <laughs> so um, this give this a try. If you guys haven't haven't read this, please go go give this a try. Um, but yes, it can it can be a bit too cheesy for some people, but I actually like this a lot. Um, yes, I still love Takagi san series, um, but I actually prefer this one. <laughs> But I actually like the characters more in this one. So um, the, the story written here is a lot better. The expressions drawn in this version, uh, or, or rather the artist has improved his uh, art style um, in this manga series compared to this one. Um, although this one has been running way longer. This one is only three volumes, while Takagi san is like volume 13. So you can tell that um, the artist definitely put all his knowledge and efforts into the the later series that he is doing um so yeah and okay the last item within this gigantic squarish box um from cd japan is something pretty old just like the series of euro camp yes it's a euro camp item and it's something that i probably might not wear <laughs> anytime soon um it's the scarf of rin so as you can see here, the illustration, so Rin is actually wearing the scarf. So yes, this is the actual scarf um, that Rin uses, you know, throughout the series that, you know, that she wears it <laughs> in whatever episodes uh, she appears in. So yeah, fantastic stuff. I do have her cap, um, the cap, the beanie, um, somewhere in the boxes here. So let's try and look for it. So let me just put this down somewhere and let's move on to the next box now this one this one is from amazon japan um the box is huge but it's kind of flat and sadly to say it, it got kind of destroyed uh, you can see like the corners are like <laughs> literally destroyed by the delivery company uh but it's okay it's amazon they they tend to put their stuff centralized in the box so even if the corners get destroyed um, most of the time the merchandise inside it uh, are pretty well protected i suppose so yeah here we go all right so apparently i have to destroy the box because it's it's literally falling apart so okay um why is there a gigantic package inside here it's not shown what i bought oh god I, i'm very curious on what i got i cannot remember because there, there seems to be two packages from amazon japan this time around so all right so let's pull this out all right and find out what in the world is this envelope okay so we got to Peel this open and oh it's the thing that i've been waiting for and patiently okay so let's see let's pull this out and there it is okay okay so this is an amazon japan exclusive item it is actually if you guys can recognize this it is actually the Animelo Summer um, Live, you know, and it comes with three, you know, I, I, I don't know why <laughs> the front is exactly the same for all three. Um, it's, it's just ridiculous. It's just the difference between the back of it because the three colors of the three days Blu-ray are mm, as so. And only amazon japan came with the any mellow box to hold the three blu-rays in so yes i am going to have to open this up and take this out so very nicely printed box um for the any mellow summer 2019 so yeah all right and here we have the three blu-rays all right so i'm gonna have to rotate this so which is day one so this is day two day one so this is day one day two the blue one and we've got day three so yes all three blu-rays goes into the box um i guess nicely even though they have plastic covers so fantastic way to keep 
the Blu-rays um, for the 2019 any uh, any summer concerts. It comes with the files. <laughs> so the files are kind of meaningless because seriously, the only thing is the colors at the back of the file. There's nothing nice printed in front of it except for the logo of you know the event. So uh, anyway, guys, look forward to watching this with me i guess sometime soon i won't announce when so if you happen to see a live stream you know it is what and you can enjoy it together with me so let me just dump this somewhere here and let's move on to the next two boxes the last two boxes as you can tell um there's like i said um there isn't much this time rounds which is fantastic so Another one from Amazon.com, JP. This one has the peel to open up the box, so let's do that. Convenience sick. Hey, so actually this is one of my orders that got split into two. I, I don't know why Amazon did it this way. Um, they It was actually one whole order by itself, but it got split in two, and in the end, both packages came on the same day, which is just ridiculous. <laughs> But the good thing is, I didn't have to pay um, two separate you know, shipping costs. So it's just one single shipping cost, but Amazon just decided to send them separately because, I don't know, maybe because the sellers are from um, two, two different regions of Japan and then they have to send it, you know, as soon as they can. So yes, more Eurocam stuff. Yes, I'm going all gaga over Eurocam. Can you blame me? It's such a lovely show. It's it's all I I'm I'm actually a pretty outgoing person, so camping and all that stuff is just up my alley, but I just wish I can find time to do it and finance myself to do it. Camping is really expensive after researching on all the you know equipment that they the girls use within the show itself. It is heck of an expensive hobby. Uh, so yes, I got shirts! Yuru Camp shirt. So here we have a very cute Rin and Nadeshiko on the shirt itself. Um, hopefully, or maybe you guys might see me wear it during the next unboxing video for April. <laughs> I, I might put on the scarf just for the sake of it. <laughs> and of course, I have Rin on her scooter. Look at that. So cute. <laughs> Alright, so aside from the two shirts here, there's one last box. Yes, there's another shirt in there with something else. Um, so let me just try and put some of the stuff away because I am running out of space. <laughs> okay. So last but not least, it's another gigantic box. Alright, this one is from CD Japan as well. Why is this one so big? Because it has manga inside and oh my goodness there's one whole buttload of manga inside it is the whole complete Yuru Camp manga collection up to its latest volume which is I, I think it was volume 10 um, so yeah so let's open this up and see what else did I get for no the UK Magnus ah okay so here we go slicing up the tape all right I'm gonna put the box down because this is just no room on my lap all right so lots of stuffing once again one book and a whole gigantic box okay so huh okay so this this entire box is actually the volume um, 1 to 9 of Yuru Camp. So it's nice that they actually packed it all in one box. At least it won't get lost or maybe damaged because it's, it is a set together. So yeah, it's just another waste of boxes and paper, you know. Hopefully all this can be recycled. I don't know. So here we go. I'm going to pull out all the volumes first before I show you the covers individually okay so here we go so we have I think they are all in order yeah they're all in order so volume one of Yuru Camp so we have Rin and Nadeshiko on it and of course volume two 
It's just another no, it's just rain and other shiko again. So lots of rain and other shiko. <laughs> so volume three, volume four. Huh. Yeah, the rest of the girls don't get much love, do they? <laughs> uh, I guess the manga artist really likes the two characters. So this is volume six. So, yep. Volume seven. So this is just Nareshiko alone. Volume eight. And finally, volume nine. And if you're wondering where is volume 10, well, volume 10 is inside this thing because these are actually new books. So the ones I showed you are actually very, very old. And uh, it's pretty hard to come by old manga. You know, uh, once the manga, or rather the, the, the comic book printers stop pr producing them and they become really expensive due to popularity and you know the ones of customers i don't know um i had a hard time finding you know a, a good complete set of euro camp um if i if i did find them it was usually very expensive um because apparently euro camp is so popular um yes <laughs> it is very popular and the Blu-ray set is also another hard thing to find. So yeah, so the latest volume, so, um, it doesn't have Nadeshiko and Rin feature on it, I suppose. So that's a good thing. So volume 10 uh, has another one of my favorite girls, you know, because she's voiced by uh, Takahashi Rie, which is also Takagi-san. <laughs> So yes, volume 10. Then of course, the latest issue of um, 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 Nagatoro. <laughs> I'm trying to remember her name. So yes, they, once again, there is an exclusive cover. This is the exclusive cover. Then there's a regular cover. I probably might leave the cover image somewhere here so you guys can compare it. So this is the, the, the special edition cover where she doesn't wear leggings and then the regular cover has leggings so then yeah it comes with i think pictorial cuts at the back as well so yes i always try to get the special editions of the mangas you know because i i just like the manga cars work and i appreciate the, the stuff and the effort put into this so yeah guys so guys that's pretty much it for the month of march <laughs> what do you guys um like about the stuff that i've showed maybe you guys personally want to try and gain yourself some of these items if you guys are Yu-Gi-Oh fans euro camp fans or maybe if you are fans of seiyus and artists who sing anime songs um yeah maybe you want to get yourself a set of the Animelo Summer Collection. Sadly to say, I don't know whether the Amazon exclusive boxes are still available. Probably not. Um, if you're trying to get it, you might have to fork up more money than usual through scalpers and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, guys, let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on the stuff that I showed today in this video um, and of course leave a like in this video if you enjoy all the goodies that i've showed off and of course you know if you leave a like if you enjoyed the live streams if you did catch it somehow or rather and subscribe for more contents just like this and i'll see you guys next month for another unboxing of we otaku merchandise bye <laughs>